Announcement Number Two Zero One Eight Zero One Zero Four. Put the three demon detecting mirrors in use. During recent years, we at the World Buddhism Association headquarters have been continuously receiving inquiries regarding upright masters and evil masters, asking for replies in this regard. However, WBAH has given replies to such questions many times publicly through announcements. Furthermore, H. H. Dorje Chang Buddha III also clearly explained many times the distinctions between what is upright and what is evil, and between what is true and what is false. Yet, many of you still act. Blindly and without a direction in the matter of recognizing and distinguishing whether a master is upright or evil, and are unable to decide on whether to continue following your current master or to find then choose another excellent master. Simply speaking, if you do not make recognition according to the announcements and are satisfied with devolving. Even all Buddhas in the ten directions are unable to save you. Now, WBAH provides you with three demon detecting mirrors, which can enable you to easily see the original forms of such evil persons, regardless of whether they are masters or disciples. The first demon detecting mirror. An absolute criterion is to see whether a master makes a big effort to facilitate the disciples to study and broadly propagate the announcements, such as the important replies from holy virtuous ones and eminent monastics from WBAH. The 35 questions with the answers or not. Any master who does not take measure to enable the disciples to study the announcement well, and rather only makes propaganda about his or her own articles, writings, books, or other types of undertaking that not only do not refer to the specifics of the announcements, but also violate the stipulations in the announcements, is definitely an evil master. The second demon detecting mirror. Regardless of what status or title the person you follow as your master has, as long as this master's level obtained from the holy test is not a level within the ranks of holy virtuous persons, and yet this master poses as a holy person or instructs the disciples to falsely brag or praise him or her as a holy person. This master is not a holy person. Since such a master imposes rules on the disciples to prevent them from doubting the master, and to force them to correspond their three karmas to the master, this is absolutely an ordinary person and is a charlatan. The third demon detecting mirror. This is about how to recognize. And distinguish holy persons. Holy persons of ancient times have long been known through historical records. Regarding holy persons of the current time, only those who attained the gold bottom levels from taking the written test and the holy exam are holy ones. On the other hand. Those who did not attain a gold bottom level after taking the examination are not holy ones. Anyone who scored a high level of blue bottoms can only be an eminent monastic or a great virtuous one. All those who oppose or persecute holy persons will be included in the name list of malicious persons. And will not be conferred an inner tantric initiation in this entire lifetime. If you have already done things that harm holy persons, 
under the instruction of an evil master, then the only way you have is to repent immediately and publicly expose the malicious and demonic evil person who instructed you to create the scene. Then your record will be deleted from the list of malicious persons and you can immediately return to your original status of a cultivator. This three demon detecting mirrors can correctly and accurately show the true faces of all evil, malicious and demonic persons and swindlers. World Buddhism Association Headquarters September 28, 2018